Hello everybody, welcome back by a new video and today it's time for a new streetlight vlog. And let's start this one with looking for faulty streetlights, which I do every time around this time of the year. And let's do it again now and let's start. So I think I can say I found the jackpot since this one isn't working and back there's one, back there's one and there are even more behind there so we have a lot. So I honestly don't think it's smart to do much more than what we did now since um, more than So tomorrow is going to be a very fun day since I and the LAMP channel are going to a traffic light replacement project and we want to take some traffic lights there because they have very old traffic lights but the problem is that we have to walk with the traffic lights like 900 meters to his house and that's going to be terrible embarrassing but we'll see how that goes tomorrow so see you tomorrow so we are walking to the actual replacement project and let's see what we can get so we kind of feel like it might take a while before they are going to take the old signals off so Got to spend some time waiting. So we got the traffic lights and we are now walking. It's not that busy here, but it was earlier and it was kind of embarrassing. And we still um, need to uh, get uh, one more traffic light. It's kind of heavy though. Yeah, this is definitely way worse than we thought. I mean, you can probably see the camera shaking. That's because this is pretty fucking heavy. Too heavy in my opinion. And we're now taking the second things, but these are less embarrassing, I think. Oh. Orange doesn't work. Nice. I'm with the lamp channel, by the way. 
So this is the signal that I took with me. Um, this is an old VLS signal. As you can see, it's very old and very dirty, but um, kind of like how dirty it is makes it look a bit older. So I'm probably not going to clean it. Will be a hell of a work anyway, because um, it's pretty dirty everywhere. So red is glass, um, green is plastic. Probably someone smashed the green light some time or something and they replaced it with this. So we can open the doors. This one is a bit hard to open. This one goes a lot easier. And we have a working halogen, I think. Yeah. So the only bad thing about, or one of the bad things about this traffic light is that it misses these things on the red light. You can just take this out. And here we have some electronics. Kind of dangerous connected, in my opinion. I mean, this doesn't look too safe. A bit better now. And here we have the, the connection that I made, made a new cable on it, and let's see if it works. And let's see what this traffic light does. And only green is working. So changed out the uh, bulb. And still doesn't work. Okay, this was my own fault. So, uh, red is the black cable and um, blue is also the red light. It's conflicting um, because blue is normally the neutral, but now it's the black, the red light. But um, it's connected here, as you can see, connected the uh, black cable too close to the brown cable. That's it. So next test, I guess, and both are working now. So it was my fault. Looks nice. So I got this thing um, too, and that's a thing that I can put on my traffic light pole outside, which you can't see since it's dark. And um, that makes that I can put four traffic lights on that pole. So. This one's going to, I'm going to put that one on there too, and but that's a project for tomorrow since it's going to be a lot of work. So yeah, that's for tomorrow. But I'm first going to clean this, but not on camera since why does that matter? So I'm aware of the fact that this is really sudden, but um, the traffic lights are all four are on the pole. So I did actually record doing it, but um, like it all wasn't really it all, didn't all go as we planned and like it took us a very long time to get all the cables through here because there's like a pretty small hole here and five cables have to go through there so that was barely fitting and it became really hot as well like the weather was really hot and we had to work in the sun so um, I decided to stop filming halfway through recording it because film, filming uh, during a project sometimes is really annoying especially when it's all not working as planned so yeah um, I'll include the clips I do have at the end of the video and yeah um, I'll show how it looks real quick so here we have these two signals wanted to Put this one on green but it isn't working I'll replace the bulb and replace some other parts as well but probably uh, i'm probably going to take another a new unit for this traffic light since the green just doesn't work and this is the same as before but on this thing and yeah um i put a made a button here which actually is original to the pole but I used to have small traffic lights on here since I thought that looked cooler, but yeah, 
this is less messy, so I decided to do this instead. And yeah, um, enjoy the clips at the end if you're going to watch them. And if you aren't, thanks for watching. Have a nice day and see you in the next video.